Hi guys. So today my topic is gonna be based on homophobia, which I hate people of the homophobic asunda. But yeah, yesterday I heard my sister since on the news they were talking about passing gay law marriage which is lovely because lately there's been a lot of passing of this law in each state so and this is gay pride month so i just want to say that because my sister saw it and she's like oh i don't think they should pass that that is so nasty but oh there are people too blah 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 bitch shut the fuck up like nobody gives a shit People are people and they are meant to love each other. I mean like where where's your head? Like come on man. But yeah. And then there's another topic regarding uh, No, it's not regarding that. But yeah, it's still based on humble. Oh yeah. But yeah. So, I'm gonna tell, tell you one confession in this video about me that I'm letting you know now. If you are a person that knows me on the streets or knows me from school or anything, just don't come up to me with all this homophobic shit because I don't give a fuck to be honest. As you, as you can see, Bitches been talking a lot of shit to me lately. <laughs> and I obviously, I still do what I do because I don't give a fuck because I'm me. Right? Yeah. You gotta love me. You gotta love me. Yep. Gotta love me. But yeah, my confession is that I'm actually gay. But I kind of lied to some people and told them I would lie because I was really afraid they might not handle gayness but I don't know why this quote is it as gayness but yeah whatever but yeah and I kind of told you about Biden before but they probably know me and I was like a little confused on what my actual orientation was but I have to come to terms that I am freely and frolicking blah 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 Nah, seriously, but just because I'm gay doesn't mean I do all this girly crap I mean, I tend to put on some perfumes because they actually smell better than, you know, you know, guys for like cologne and shit like Axe That shit gives me a headache so much, I don't know how you do it. It's just annoying. But, but yeah, and then, you know, I do put on, I don't know, I don't know if you can see it or not. But, yeah. But, um, yeah, but if you see me in the streets and you watch this video, don't come up to me about, like, Oh, you're gay, that is blah blah blah. Listen here. I can call it faggot, fag, fag bag, faggotron, gay, blah blah blah, but still I don't give a fuck. I just look at when you call me it, I just look at you like <laughs> like But yeah, I am so liberal on my homophobic ass family which I can't stand. I can't wait to move out. <sighs> but I wish I had the moolah to move out. But apparently don't. I'm working for it. And um God I keep forgetting what I'm about to say. But yeah I'm not fully out. I'm only out to some people like my closest friends. Yeah I actually had a conflict with one of my closest friends because I actually had a crush. You know, it's it's like very, very complicated. You know. Yeah, but me and him are like 
friends, but like not so much friends as before. I'm not even sure if he wants to be near me anymore, but we've been in friends for like a lot, really long time. He had so many memories, so it's like oh, if he decides not to be my friend anymore, I have like hard time like giving that friendship thing up so I tend to go back and try to grab by like the lion and shit to try to make it better but yeah I have a hard time of letting that go but but you don't understand you just have to live with but it's been hard for me because I have trust issues and all that. But still haven't found the right guy yet. If the right guy knows him. Yeah, but in, this, in terms of homophobia, you know, even some people on the streets don't know I am, but they tend to you know call me every fucking word in the book but still I don't give a fuck but, um I gotta move out this neighborhood because it's very stressful and not a lot of people liking me so there's not much to do like I rarely go outside because there's a lot of hoodlums who tend to be on that list of horror fucking people so my tip for you is that if you love yourself, then be yourself. If you be yourself, people are gonna like you for you. Don't let others put you down. Don't be stupid, cause I'm not gonna lie, I have been stupid enough some like a couple of times now that I actually let people actually sit here and put me down, which I don't know why. Cause then I come become extremely depressed and listen to the wrong kind of music and yeah, but yeah, be yourself, love yourself. If you don't love yourself, no one's gonna love you. So you gotta love yourself in order for people to love you for you. Because if you don't, then I don't know what to tell you. You're just not going to have people loving you for you. So, yeah, I hope you like this video. Um, if you have any questions or comments you want to leave me, leave down below. I will surely get back to you on them. And please don't send negative shit like, oh... Just negative shit, period. I'm sorry for cussing, I gotta stop that. But yeah, hope you like this video and I hope you subscribe. So, see ya. Bye.